Ah, uh, what's up guys? No, it's been a minute. I uh, haven't had any videos out here in a while. Just life been busy, but uh, we're back at it with some install videos today. So what I got today was uh, this guy's over at Snail Armor were nice enough to shoot me over a Gladiator panel. All this is going to do is go right onto our tailgate, uh, get rid of kind of this uneven surface. So, you know, you think about whenever you're trying to go out and put your cup down, your drinks, your tools, whatever you're working on, cooking surfaces, you know, you got uneven spots all over and then you got to kind of figure out where you want that. Um, so what this is going to do is just clean this look up here, got some custom uh, etch graphics on it. Uh, and really just make it a better surface to work on. So let's go ahead and get that installed. All right, let's get this thing opened up. Take a look at it. So they do offer some custom laser etching if you want on there, whatever you want. Uh, these are aluminum. So, you know, it can be pretty light. Uh, still gonna retain that function of the soft opening of the tailgate. But yeah, I wanna head through and just got Mountaineer put on here. Uh, put some latitude and longitude uh, coordinates here of a meaningful spot. This is where I grew up. Um, and yeah, I have a little logo at the bottom. So let's go ahead and get this mounted up. Uh, one thing too, you know, this is the flattest panel they offer on the market for gladiators. Got the counters on coals, so you don't have to worry about anything ever catching when you're loading, unloading your truck. Um, or cooking, or whatever on these surfaces. So let's go and get it installed. Pretty sweet. Comes with our instructions here. Uh, it's always nice that it even comes with the provided T27 bit. So don't even really need any tools other than maybe a ratchet to set this into. But our hardware here, some decals, some stickers, it's always a plus. So uh, yeah, quick and easy. Let's get this going. All right, so I've gone ahead and just laid it out here, kind of understand which screws I'm gonna take out from the factory. Uh, panel. Um, you do have the option here to take off your whole factory panel if you want to to get it to be a little bit flatter to your tailgate. Um, if not, it'll just be slightly elevated. I'm just going to leave this one on here, uh, the factory one, and just kind of have that little slightly elevated lift to it. That'll be fine with me. And then also, it is recommended the construction to take off our access panel here just so we can get a little bit flatter uh, flush fit to the tailgate. So we're going to remove this, uh, take out our quarter space screws, and then uh, we're going to go ahead and get this installed here and see how it sits. Apparently got too hot and my camera shut off. So what I did was actually ended up removing the top tailgate panel piece. Uh, it was smaller than I expected. So I'm just gonna take this one off so we'll sit a little more flush. Um, about eight screws for that one. And then I'm gonna take off the access panel down here as well. So access panel, keep these in storage in case we ever need them. Um, yeah, so you can see, just went ahead and just install this. It was uh, eight screws, Phillips head, so I'm gonna have to go grab a screwdriver for that to put those in there. Um, if you're OCD like me, you've got them all lined up the right way. We're just gonna pop this off and show you what this profile looks like. Cool. So, as you can see, I did do some of the custom etching in here offered by uh, Snail Armor, so just some latitude, longitude coordinates I wanted in here from kind of my hometown where I grew up. Uh, Mountaineer, just you know, from West Virginia, went to Mountain. Uh, Went to WVU. Uh, this is kind of the Mountaineer Gladiator, as I've dubbed it on Instagram. So, yeah, super flat panel. Um, kind of see going across here, all the way smooth and flush. So, you know, as we're going to maybe put cooking supplies on here, uh, you know, grab anything like a cup. Don't have to worry about it now. You know, trying to find that perfect soft, sweet spot for it to uh, not fall over. So, quick, easy way. Slide it around. It is aluminum, so all of the functions should still work just right. Cross this over here. So you can see, easy to put up. And then we should still retain our soft open. Yep. Alright, my camera wants to just keep shutting off. It is hot here today in the Carolinas. 
Uh, but yeah, got this installed. Super quick, easy video this week, guys. Uh, shout out to Jimmy for shooting this over to me to get installed uh, and doing some of the custom etch work on it here. Uh, very appreciative of that. So yeah, if y'all want to get one of your own, I will link below, uh, put in the comments uh, where you can actually pick one of these up from Snail Armor. So again, shout out to Snail Armor, shout out to Jimmy. Uh, if you liked the video today, feel free to like and subscribe. There'll be more coming again in the future here. Yeah. Back and I'm better than ever. Whoa. I think I got a vendetta. Oh, now they call me, I seen them. Yeah. All of those times getting severed. I told them all I can let up. Oh. They get not tired of me, never. Yeah. Give me a shot and I, ooh. I swear I shoot.